Hello everyone and welcome back and we are in my spaghetti hall as I call it because look at all of this spaghetti and all of those <laughs> liquids just going between everything um, so yeah we have a problem despite doing all this which we are now you know for the most part keeping up with our oil um, productions here I say for the most part because we are converting a lot of the um, liquids here to about two major resources which is light oil and um, petroleum gas just to make these two things but and we're also converting some of that heavy oil into uh, the lubricant here but the real problem is is that we clearly have a limitation of the oil here I added this in because I needed more light oil which kind of holds precedence right now but I'm not making enough heavy oil now so now I'm like debating do I switch one of these machines to doing heavy oil it can't be this one because I don't have the space for all of this now so that's kind of a problem uh, actually I can if I did this because then if I switch this to output this this might help just like that like that now we should be making yeah we're a little steadier I say a little bit not much a little steadier with the heavy oil production and I think that'll hold for now for the most part the real problem here is that we're creating clearly enough light oil here. It's getting used up. Yeah, we're, we're creating enough light oil. Plenty of light oil, but we're not creating enough heavy oil. It's tough to get the ratios right because I'm not entirely sure exactly how these ratios work. I'm just trying to get these done and out of the way because this will go fast. Um, I think this will hold for now. We really need to increase the or decrease the use of the light oil. The light oil is being used to make solid fuel. This whole system, I all I really know is that I need a tons more sulfur, which means sulfur needs to be organized a lot better and if I can get two sulfur making machines into this area that would be ideal so we might do that all I know is that this is just definitely not going to be enough sulfur so in order to do this we're going to need to create a lot more of this and I don't think this whole setup is going to work for us in the long run it's just too messy and we need a lot so we might deconstruct all of this and restart and try to like rehash everything so that everything seems to create us a lot more of everything because we just we, we, there's a really a major limitation here and the limitation is is that despite all of these oil refineries one two three four five and a fuel refinery and two or three four chemical plants and another oil so six oil refineries we still aren't making enough um, of our sulfur and our plastic and I really need that to be heavily provided by these machines and we're just not doing enough so we might undo it all so let's let's go ahead and redo this together We don't have enough. Damn it. Damn it. Alright, well. Let's go ahead and eliminate it all. Because we, we're going to need to redo all of this. Need to do it all. We ran out of... Shouldn't have done that. I'm wasting all this lubricant I just made and all this other fluids, but. Just 
Just gotta get it all in there, because we're gonna restart all of this. We really need to make this a little tighter, too. We, we were, like, anticipating the need for space, but there are certain things that we can get around with our pipe work. So, what are we piping in from these rooms here? Anything? Water from there. Nothing from there. Okay, so we have two things piping in from there. I think we have nothing coming in from there. We've got coal coming in from here. Nothing else coming in from there. I think those are the main ingredients we have coming in, so let's just make sure that's the case. Um, don't have the ability to do... Oh, uh, yeah, we do have that. All right. We have oil and water coming in. We have more oil coming in here over here. Which I don't know that is really necessary. And we have lubricant leaving over there and light oil leaving here. Um, Let's also eliminate this factory here, because we don't know that this is staying here. It could be moving. We don't know for sure. We don't know enough about that, so let's wait and see. And we really don't know that this is where uh, lubricant's going to be leaving from either. But we do seem to have... And this too. Okay, let's go ahead and do the next science. We're kind of just focusing on doing this a little bit, a little here. So we got water, we got our fluids here. There's even more oil down here, which we may... Can we get a few more oil refineries made up? No, we need steel. Let's get a few more oil refineries, dude, because I don't want the limitation to be that we don't have enough oil. Ah, come on. So we need some of this stuff. some steel uh, start the next thing we could do trains eventually too it's gonna be coming up soon all right we don't know how many we're gonna need but we should do that for now all right we have a few more oil spots right here how many more oil spots do we have? Oh, quite a significant amount. Um, I don't know that we're going to be able to do much with this, but let us see. One. Two. Two. Three. Trying to get some of the stone out of the way here. Four, five, six. Quite a bit of oil over here. Now I don't know if we get too close that we're gonna have an issue with biters. Yes, we will. Yep, we did. Okay, we need to go get prepared for that. And make a few more of those. Oh yeah, we're done, man. We're done for. We are dead. <laughs> that was a mistake. We should not have done that. Don't poke the bear. case the aliens and we need 
need some pipes. Uh, probably need some more belts. Uh, let's get this going. And we need some weapons. Make a handful of things. Alright, so maybe by the time we get down there, we'll be able to defend ourselves with a little bit of machinery. I don't want to go into this too fast, so let us... See as much space as I can. Okay. Are all of our oil derricks destroyed? No, not completely. Or are they? Look at all these plates. Uh, these are just where you can name your sections of your place, it looks like. Alright, so let's get three of these placed down. One. We are not prepared for this fight. I need to place down a turret as soon as it's done being made. Oh gosh. Alright. We'll come back when we're ready to fight these things. A turret, and before I knew it, I was getting attacked and I couldn't start the recording in time. But that's okay. Oh, forgot my phone. So we are protected, at least partially here. So we are going to add another turret down here to help protect this amount here. Can we make one more? No, but that's okay. Um, we will start with that, and we will bring this up. And I think that'll help us with production a little bit. I just want to see, do we have any other spots right now? No, that's it. Okay, so i got four more pumps here. I need to get to my corpse. There it is. Uh, let's put the rest of our pumps down, just like that. And we didn't bring large electrical poles, did we? No, it does not appear so. But we do have a RoboPort. Oh, now we have RoboPorts. That's exciting because we could use those. We have to put in our better equipments and jetpacks and stuff of that nature. Modular armor. Um, nanobots. Med pack. Do we need anything to equip ourselves with anything here? No, right? No, no, no. We're good. All right, so we have all that. We can do some power, but we need better power. We want the big power lines. Um, and then we want some of these. The reason why we want the big power plants and the medium poles is because we want to be able to reach as much as we can here. Okay, so those are all connected. And then now we need to get some big light poles going to get us all the way back up to our other section here. These big light poles are great for this because they go such a long distance. All right, so they connect. Now we just need to get our pipes over. We're gonna practice just going vertically with it. It's just a lot easier to walk in one direction and then come back over. Just like. 
like that. And then we'll start coming over. And connect you up. Just like this. So now all of that is pumping nice and strongly. Let's get the next uh, adaptive armor that uses energy to self repair. Cool. Definitely want to like. We have night vision, we have personal batteries, we have belt immunities, but is there any other modular armor stuff we could build right now that we have inventory for? We could build a jetpack. That's nice. That would help. Need to build two of these. Need to build one. What am I building two of them for? All right, and then that should be enough for that. We're gonna definitely build a personal robot board at some point too, because at the very least, I like that my character at least acts as a charging station and repairs things as we go. Now this warehouse is nice and all, but it's only an MK1, so you know what? I'm starting to think maybe we eliminate this, build a bigger one. Um, storage chest. All right, so we have an MK3, an MK2, an MK1. It's a 30 by 30. This one's a 46 by 46, and this one's a 60 by 60. I need lots of concrete, lots of stone. I don't think we're gonna be able to carry all that. <laughs> and 10, uh, 100 substations. Oh my gosh. All right, so maybe we shouldn't have deleted that. It's making things a lot more difficult. Um, you know what? Forget it. What are we building that thing for? Just for the sake of showing you that we can build it, we can just build it out here. So that's exactly what we're going to do. We are not going to do all this other garbage. So let us look at this in a way that makes sense. All right. So first things first, oil refineries. We need a butt ton of them. Um, I want to leave at least one space between each of them. Now I'm feeling stupid because I need to feel like I need to go one more space over. Two, three, four, five, six. Let's go ahead and move you over to just like that. All right. So now we're going to focus on building all of these out for this light oil and a heavy oil. I think we'll start with that and then let's hook all of these up to oil. I did hook that up, right? Yeah, that looks right. Just like this. This one we might move. We might move you just because you are really close to the others, so we'll put you up here. Just like that. I think that's fine. And then we'll do all oil, right? Because we do light oil. Okay, so that's the start. Just like that. Now, we can do this. Oil is now flowing into all of them. And then we need water flowing into all of them, so let's get water flowing out. Just like this, we'll have it come down right in front. I'm not the best at doing this. I'm just trying to leave some space for some expansion if needed. All right, now 
now they're all making what we need them to make. All right, so we need a butt ton of chemical plants. Can we make more chemical plants? We can, so let's make a handful more. Let's go ahead and get the science going on steam turbines. We're going to start swapping over to um, steam engine power. Over, we've just been expanding with the whole burning of fuel thing, and I think we ought to do something a little different here. All right, so let's also get... I guess we could just use regular power poles here. As long as they reach, yep. Hey, everybody's working. And then we have our chemical plants. Same thing. Just like that. Oh wow, we have a lot coming. Um, Alright, so we need sulfur. We need sulfur. And we need sulfur. And we need sulfur. Let's quadruple our sulfur output. So sulfur needs liquid, uh, ne needs our liquefied petroleum, which we can connect right up to here. Uh, we're gonna need to do a little bit of a connection here somehow, because we want all these pipes connected somehow. Just like that. one logistic network interfacing sure just working on all the science um, and then you need to be connected over here as well so let us just do it like that keep the same system going so at least it's uniform okay and then you're gonna move because we don't know where you're gonna go you're probably gonna pop out of one of these here okay so that's that. Now let's get some plastic going. Let's do about four times the plastic. Plastic just needs liquefied petroleum, so that's all we're going to hook up to it. Let's worry about that next. But... Thank you. 